Hi Virgo, welcome. We're here for you. This is your read. This is your June 2023 read. We're gonna jump into what is to come during this month. Uh, this is going to be one card for each of the days. Every so often we do this read. Thank you guys for your support. Let me know also how you like this particular uh, read style. This is uh, Isaac, he's a Gemini. <laughs> and yeah guys, thanks for joining us if it's your first time. And if it's not, uh, thank you for continuing with the collective here on the channel Alchemy and You. So what's going on? I'm seeing the number three, three here. Some of you here, Virgo, I was meditating on your energy uh, and I am a starseed oracle medium here. I'm a channeler. I'm very much sensitive to say to energy. And so I'm picking up on the subtle wavelengths of frequency as we are moving through this particular uh, download space. Okay, well this upload and download. So we're working with your guides and your higher self on these messages. So uh, do keep an open mind with how they may sort of resonate. I would recommend to come back over time as they may resonate in different ways over time. Let's get into it. So Virgo, I was getting that someone here around you, I'm seeing a big letter C here. Uh, is uh, hoping that they have another shot with you. I feel like they saw you for some of you. I see um, a, a, some kind of, it's like, looks like a construction vehicle that just drove in. Uh, some of you, I see something about um, Italian. Uh, and then I'm seeing, uh, like I'm seeing the Italian flag. And then I'm seeing um, something about uh, golfing. Okay, so super specific little details for someone here it can be i'm seeing graph paper as well some of you this person saw you somewhere and like they're hoping that they're gonna bump into you again so okay let's see let's see a little further um what's what well, like yeah i feel like you guys made eye contact even but you couldn't quite make out even like if this person was receptive or not some of you this person doesn't know if you're single okay they could be someone new i'm hearing james james i'm hearing jamie okay so Let's see. <laughs> Jump up, Isaac. Jump up. Jump up, doll. All right. Yeah. Jay came through in the Gemini reading. I'm hearing Jerry very strongly. I'm hearing Lauren. I'm hearing Rupert. Something about someone's dog as well. We did have Isaac in the very beginning of this video, so that might be a message. So maybe this, yeah, as you see if this person keeps seeing you, you could be a Gemini. Some of you, they're like looking at you. Um, it's a gem and I had, okay, yeah, something come through, uh, something of a message about their social media come through. Something here about this card, for whatever reason, looks kind of like the backdrop of it is like an off-white rather than white. The rest of the backdrops, hmm, they vary. Yeah, the strength card looks a little green. Tinge of green. Anyway, some of them are just like flash white. Some of them are a little bit like off-white. So that could be someone's message right there. Uh, almost like when something is kind of stained yellow. Anyhow, one, two, three, four. You should think of teeth whitening. What in the Virgo? No, why did the Virgos go? Okay, Spirit's like, we just need to confirm that we're in the Virgo reading. Okay, I don't know why some people would be, yeah, mistaken, but anyways, it's like, yeah, you are definitely in the Virgo reading. Now we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Some of you, maybe you're doubting that this person even saw you. No, no, Spirit's saying they saw you and they want to see you again, okay? So something about a pool. They could be hoping that y'all are going to meet up. Now, maybe you're, you know that you guys are hanging out. I'm seeing something about America. This person wants to hang out with you again. Some of you are like, I don't know if they, yeah, they really like, we're feeling it, they were feeling it, and they want to hang out again. Some of you, you were at yoga, or you were out, to, yeah, you were doing something. This, you were telling them about your day, like just in passing. I feel like they really like you. They really like you. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wow, it just feels so noisy right there. I don't know. Oh, it's a truck. Okay. It's just like stalling, I guess. Uh, however, I don't know. Oh, well. Yeah, maybe some of you, you like pass by this person again and you're like, I don't know if they really took a note of me. If they felt some sort of way or however, but yeah. So I hear it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Some of you don't know each other by name yet. Okay, I see a donut. They could be giving you like a free pastry. Some of you are wondering if that's like random. No, it's not. They really like you. Like they're doing that on purpose. We're, we're right there. Okay, so we have the moon and the theme. Like there's a lot of this passion I feel underneath the surface. It's just building. 
with the strength card at the base of the moon card. Feel free to comment how many of you are on the cusp of like a new beginning with your love life. I feel like that's coming for a lot of people here. In the last years, we've had so much clearing, okay? Let's just clear it mm -hmm. in the third eye. Yeah. So some of you here, this is also someone who knows you by way of another person. I feel like they are trying to get to know you better. Okay, obviously make it your message by watching other signs as well. There could be further little details. I would like to get on who this is. Who's this person who, who took note? Okay, who's this person who took note and is uh, aware of you? It could be something about a cafe that popped out. Like a, I'm hearing, ooh, this is a song with Katy Perry. Like a skyscraper? I don't know. Virgo Scorpio. So, we are in the Virgo reading. <laughs> I see you like trying to keep yourself busy, like trying not to be super attentive, but I see that you are picking up on this person. You're wondering maybe if they are picking up on you. It says who they are, the detailed strategist. On a hike together, enjoying the sunshine. They move and live with intention. Cancer Capricorn. I feel like they were maybe trying to act like they're not super focused on you, but they were. Cancer Capricorn, uh, simplifying and beautifying their lifestyles, the divine counterparts, something about the number 19 coming in, they tune out the noise and tune into each other. Did we just say it was super noisy? Maybe someone's very sensitive to noise. Or you guys, uh, were you met in a very noisy place? Like, there could have been construction going on. The legendary rebels, rallying the masses for a humanitarian cause. They may butt heads, but they also make each other stronger. Some of you are meeting up in a work setting. And we have Aries. It says, I am more than what you think I am. <laughs> wow, very Aries. Okay. So let me let, let me show you. Let me prove it. Did you doubt me? Okay. <laughs> All right. I feel like you guys, um, you're very cute together. Maybe, you know, if you were actually together. Uh, oh, so maybe you're just friends. But yeah, I see someone really wants to meet up with someone again. And I feel like they do want to, they want to know more about you. Like if you're single and whatnot, we have Virgo Libra, Sagittarius, Sagittarius, Aries Leo. So it says the thrill seekers, the masters of manifestation and the shining rays. Maybe they even tried to like make a move on you, but they're wondering if it was clear enough. So let's see here a little bit more. Okay. Who is it? Who are you as the querent of this message? get further confirmation and i see a bunny rabbit i feel like this person uh, it does see you like in that way maybe you're thinking they just see you as a friend or however or a colleague mm -hmm. <laughs> they want to like they want they're wondering like what it'd be like to hang out like out outdoors specifically mars virgo pisces virgo sagittarius Vir leo aquarius maybe you guys are more in like a theoretical setting mm. could also be a, some kind of project that you want to really go more publicly with maybe you've been thinking about it in your head and it's like i'm now ready to really I want to pursue this this degree i'm hearing that so it could be something you've been researching you had your eye on as even an industry and you're ready to sort of pursue it we have so much sag coming through here wow taurus and Jairus. someone really likes the pool or swimming or something about water you guys could be texting when you're at the pool okay taurus cancer again wow and where is pisces so you could have a lot of sagittarius a lot of taurus you can have Taurus on an angle, specifically the I see for some of you. Uh, a lot of Cancer as well. Aquarius, Leo, you could be in the limelight. You may travel for a living. You could also have a lot of Virgo in your chart, Aries, and some Pisces. So let's get here. Um, I'd like to get on either either conversation point. What? <laughs> what do you feel towards this person? Oh, that popped right out. Is that strange? Oh, the Emperor. Some of you here, it's like, I feel like you feel that this is uh, something very attractive. Like, this is, I mean, for some of you feel this is your person. Maybe you're kind of waiting on this person to make a move first. Now, how does this person feel towards you? The Nine of Pentacles, they're not sure if they're making a clear enough image here of themselves. I feel they're a little bit self-conscious, like, they're trying to get your attention, but they're not sure if it's really coming across that way. Okay, so let's get here a little bit more. They're, they want to really like talk they they um they're very they are very talkative and they could have a lot of gemini they want to sort of um start to like open up that combo maybe they feel like should they just talk to you a little bit they'd be able to really open up more about who they are in a relationship capacity or you know maybe for instance they want you to know that they're single specifically 
maybe you know them as being with someone, but they want to explain, like, I'm single these days. So take it as you will. Yeah. Furthermore, how do you feel with this person? The moon, strength, the ace of wands, like, you're very drawn in. But it's like, I see, like, you... You're very curious. Do the Wheel of Fortune. So it's just a matter of that opportunity. And I feel like it's come around a few times, but... It's like, okay, now what are we going to do? Like, what about the next time? Okay, Six of Cups and the Six of Swords. Like, some of you here, I feel like you, um, I want to see more of why you're not making a move. Yeah, uh, you, uh, maybe every time you meet up, it's like just not good timing. Okay, honestly, for some, like, or, um, you need to know better what it is that, yeah, there's something that, um, let's clear the energy yeah maybe it's throwing you off even like every time you hang out there's something that is kind of like there's a factor for a small number of you you're not sure if this person would be receptive like you're not sure how to even uh how do you feel this person feels about you maybe it's even a little awkward it's like uh oh hi uh i gotta go this way oh bye okay it's like something not quite smooth okay justice in the sun so okay what's the barrier let's get on that the death card you could be finishing up a cycle you maybe are not quite feeling like your entire self or there's some factor here uh some of you you may be shy or, or flip it you know if it's this person like someone here is more shy they may be also um some of you you're famous so a lot of different timelines here you may be famous and you're not a lot of time a lot of different um factors like you're not quite sure if this is the right move for you it's like i don't know like should i open my doors yeah i want to see the outcome of this because yeah i feel like there's a lot of chemistry between you and this person eight of swords and whoa all the cards just went flying the devil in reverse the two of pentacles are bright i feel like uh it's still nerve-wracking whatever this is it could be that you're trying to take a certain situation to a more clear obvious sort of point with this person um I want to get down to like is this just flirtation we have the queen of wands in reverse the six of pentacles some of you i feel like you're very attracted to this person though it's like you do want to explore this responsibility magician maybe you want to like talk first online more and get more comfortable there i like to see uh in terms of long term because we can have a crush you know but is yeah um maybe this person has something in their life that they know they cannot pursue this can i just want to make sure that that's not what we're looking at again the eight of swords Hmm. Why is that? Something could be co controversial or complicated with the Hermit in Reverse. Someone may also, uh, they may have trust issues I hear or some situation where something about their personality they know may be hard to come, come around to, okay? Something about their personality. It's like they may be, um, again, the death card devil the four of swords like someone maybe is is if they could bypass this what would they want with you the ace of pentacles the two of pentacles the sun they want to know that you really like them as well this person doesn't want to make the first move or again apply it the other way around someone here wants to make sure that you really are into them so take it as you will we'll see you in the next video bye